care from an Oildale resident who witnessed Tucker being arrested today. We also have reaction from one of the victims who saw Tucker on Saturday night when he's accused of pointing a gun at those kids. First 23 ABC's Gracie Aguilar is in our studio now to tell us how he, they feel knowing Tucker is back behind bars tonight. Gracie. Well, Jackie, the Oildale resident says he's surprised after seeing the arrest happening just a couple of houses down from his home. And the mother of one of the victims from Saturday's night's incident says she feels a little relieved Tucker's in custody, but is still on edge. After two days of being on the run from law enforcement, 44-year-old Edward Tucker was finally arrested in Oildale this afternoon. It's kind of surprising that something like this would happen uh, coming from that residence. Isaiah Canales lives a couple of houses down from where Tucker was arrested. He says he came back home to find the block surrounded with unmarked patrol cars and even a SWAT team. He didn't appear to be aggressive at all. He just kind of had his head hanging down and... Um, you know, walked to the car and got in the back seat. Canales says it's not uncommon seeing law enforcement patrolling Oildell, but it's ironic the suspect in question was one of their own. I think it's uh, quite humorous, to be honest with you. Uh, seems how it happens to be a deputy sheriff himself. So um, I guess I'm pleased. Meanwhile, in South Bakersfield, where Tucker pointed a gun at a group of kids on Saturday, the mother of one of the kids, who doesn't want to reveal her identity for fear of her safety, got a call from Casey as so shortly after his arrest. And it was just a wonderful rel relief that he was just off the street. She says her family has been on edge since the weekend, finding it hard to go on with their lives. In this whole situation just made us be so much more alert and you know, and aware and uh, sort of afraid of everything and anyone. Despite knowing Tucker is behind bars tonight, she says her family still fears he'll come back. Knowing that he might be able to make bail and he might be out again, you know, it's, it's, it's kind of like if he was still out, you know, so it's, it's still scary. Now, the mother says she plans on pressing charges against Tucker. As for Tucker, he's scheduled to be in court on next Monday. In the Live Center, Gracia Aguilar, 23ABC.